They're applying some pressure to those above them. That said, Yuma Kagiyama has a fairly comfortable margin already, by over 11 points ahead of the Swiss skater. Yuma has said it will only include two quads in this free skate. And they're marking through the takeoff of the Salco, which will be the first jumping pass for the 20 year old from Yokohama. Was his trademark that quadruple circle just floats? As did the quad toe with the Euler and the triple circle following it. Triple Axel was intended to finish the phasing of the music. It's a single. Scratch on the back outside edge didn't stop that triple axle double toe from being successful. Complex footwork. Oh, nice inside axle within the step sequence. Wow. 
I don't think you realize how much you miss somebody till you see a skate like that. How missed he was last season when you see such a brilliant free skate. And whilst he has not offered the same technical element score as we saw him use towards the world silver medals that he achieved in the past, I think he has grown artistically as a skater. That step sequence was just epic. And it was both interesting, poignant, and a little sad to hear him talk after the short program and just acknowledge he has a lot of painful memories from last year. As you see the emotion that he's brought to the fans of him that are here in Angers. But he said last year is last year, and he feels like he's starting from zero. I don't think that's starting from zero. That's starting from a place of amazing skating skill quality. And I think Carolina Costner and his father moved by that skate for sure. They'll have seen it in practice, but there's an extra element of energy given in competition environment. Here, the Quetzalco. And I wonder if any plus fives made it onto the score sheet for that element. Quato, good height, good length, good takeoff, good landing, effortless throughout. If it matches the music, then he can be looking at some of the highest grades of execution of any jumping passes this season. Catalina looks on there. You can see that little scratch on the back edge preparation for the axle. Since he doesn't like the axle as much as the quad jumps, but cleanly done. And you can see the fingertip extension and attention to detail heading into that inner bower. And a triple flip was followed with choreographic intention. He has Laurie Nickel and Carolina Costner working with him on the choreography, as also Shailen Bourne. Amazing inputs. And also his father, so responsible for his success. His father, he was a Winter Olympic figure skater in the early 90s himself. So it won't match the score he achieved at the Olympics when he had a higher tech score, but it will be a season's best. 175. He has components of composition and presentation in the eights, which he won't be happy about. He wants all his components to push up to the nines. And I'm pretty sure it won't be long before he return to that level soon. 